Yeah, for sure. It was uh, not very mellow. I felt like uh, all the sections were, you know, pretty big and beefy as far as uh, the, the size of the jumps and stuff went. So it's um, definitely a strange, uh, strange first round for us, but it is what it is. I, I didn't really expect anything else because the 450 race is pretty, pretty open, so they want some action, and um, I think, uh, yeah, I think it's, it's kind of par for the course. Not extra pressure, um, maybe just um, was a little anxious with just the whole program. I, I wanted to get racing and it feels good to take a win on a day where I didn't feel really maybe 100%. I just was kind of tick off all day. So I know that I have a lot more in the tank and I know that it can uh, can get better from here. I felt like uh, I expect a lot of myself and, and I want to go there every day and perform. And um, I had a couple of rough days so it was not like I was peaked and then you know, was coming down or something like that. It's, it's just um, I was putting too much pressure on myself to come there every day and and yeah, just kill it. No, I mean uh, you expect to come to the first race and have some super fast guys. It's it's normal. So um, no, I think it's it's going to be a tight field, and I think there's a lot more talent on this coast than what people give it credit for. So yeah. I think that's just my style. I think when I don't have that will anymore, that'll be the day that I that I stop racing. So for me, I just want to, you know, I've, I've kind of made my money on my fitness the last couple of years, and I think that um, that's just the way I ride. It's it's a will thing, but you have to have the fitness to cover that down the long stretch, you know. So um, it's a little bit of both. I think the difference is in, the, in my consistency just from riding with Marv and, and Brock and Jason like every day and being pushed to, pushed to a new limit, I think it's, um, that's the biggest difference.